heard a lot of these fans keep putting his key, keep putting key shine in the ring with us for some reason. And we was slow to him. We was we was slow to him. That's and right. Mark Castro, everybody that they think is in Floyd class. So we want to get him in the ring. So we'll fight Key Shine. It'll be easy. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it couldn't have been made any clearer. You know, Floyd Kid Austin Schofield, the undefeated champion with a record of 11 and 0, you know, with nine wins, by the way, a knockout fresh off, you know, his TKO victory, you know, over Guerrero, you know, um, in spectacular fashion. You know, it's clear that, you know, he wants Keyshawn Davis. You know, it's clear that he wants ev anybody. You know, um, let's just make it clear. And this is no, you know, shot at Keyshawn Davis. It's just, you know, you got two young, you know, um, boxers in the division, you know, um, almost in a collision course. You know, um, both of them hot as fish grease. You know, um, Keyshawn Davis, you know, um, you know, undefeated. Both, both um, fighters untouchable, you know, um, since they turned pro. You know, uh, of course, we all know Kid Austin with a, a little bit more fights under his belt than Keyshawn with five and oh, with four wins, by the way, a knockout. You know, um, so clearly, you know, um, as you can see, very impressive resumes, to say the least. Keyshawn, you know, um, with top rank, you know, um, Kid Austin with Golden Boy Promotions, you know, everybody all know what's going on with top rank, ESPN, the whole situation. You know, um, he's got a major fight coming up, you know, in Jersey, you know, um, at the um, pay-per-view. He, he just um, had a win against uh, a TKO against Sanchez, you know, in spectacular fashion as well, you know, um, and it, it's, it's just, they're like, like I stated before, these are the most exciting fighters right now as well, you know, um, clearly Kid Austin feels like, you know, this would be easy work for him, you know, both fighters, obviously, you know, similar, you know, defensively, you know, hit, do not get hit, you know, um, it would be crazy to see if th these two actually want to step foot in that square circle, you know, um, because I believe it would be a chess match. I believe that um, Kid Austin, <laughs> pardon me, um, I believe Floyd Kid Austin Schofield and Keyshawn Davis, you know, it would be a chess match. The first person to make a mistake will pay, you know, um, I do not believe that. Floyd Kid Austin Schofield will be the one to make that first mistake at all, to say the least. I believe Floyd Kid Austin Schofield, you know, um, with the utmost confidence, will take down Keyshawn Davis, you know. Um, and Keyshawn Davis is a is a great fighter as well. You know, like I stated before, this is not a knock to Keyshawn. You know, I just believe that Kid Austin is just on another level. You know, um, both fighters, you know, confident, feeling like, you know, they are the greatest fighters, you know, um, of this generation. They're looking to leave a lasting impact. You know, um, I just believe that Kid Austin is just on a, on a different level right now than a lot of fighters, you know, um, truly in the class of his own, um, just continuing to bud um, on the horizon, you know. Um, everybody's talking about him, and this, this Golden Boy acquisition has just made it even brighter. You know, so um, I'm just I'm just asking, you know, wh wh how can we get this fight done? You know, um, obviously Bob Arum, you know, uh, over there at top rank, you know, um, Oscar De La Hoya over there, Golden Boy, you know, the, we need they need to sit down, you know, um, and this fight needs to happen. This would be a major fight, you know. Um, I know that people want to protect the um, undefeated streaks. You know, but Kid Austin is ready to get in there. You know, um, give credit to Keyshawn. He fought a tough opponent in Sanchez the last fight. You know, um, he, he, he had a good, um, he was a good challenger as well. You know, these guys had great resumes. You know, Kid Austin, I believe, can get on the inside on Keyshawn and, and really make him pay. You know, obviously, Kid Austin, his defense is impeccable. You know, uh, Keyshawn Davis is um, very similar, you know, in that aspect. You know, um, this will be a great bout, y'all. 
you know, but what does this say, you know, um, for a guy like Kid Austin to call out fighters like this? This is this speaks very highly of him. This is the kind of fights that this guy wants. A lot of people shying away from, you know, these kind of encounters, you know, but Kid Austin is welcoming them, you know, um, and I believe that Kid Austin is looking to add more to his resume and Keyshawn Davis would be another number you know, in Kid Austin's win column, you know, um, if they were to step in that square circle, you know, um, it, it'd be a spectacular fight. I want to know in the comment section, what are y'all thoughts? How would this fight go down between Keyshawn Davis and Floyd Kid Austin Schofield? You know, um, it, it, this is the fight, y'all. Um, how, how can we get this done? You know, uh, Kid Austin is in the position right now for, to, to make fights like this happen. You know, so it, it, it's got to go down. So uh, it's, it, can Keyshawn answer the call, you know, is the question. Will Keyshawn answer the call, you know, will he answer this challenge or will he continue to move on and, you know, allow top rank and this, that, and the third. And, you know, he's clearly on record of saying he's going to have some fun with his next opponent. You know, um, if he was to fight Floyd Kid Austin Schofield, there would be absolutely no fun. You know, um, it'd be an all-out attack. You know, um, this is this is the fight, y'all. Uh, this is that. This is what we all want to see. You know, Kid Austin, his power is just on another level. And I'm not. I don't think that these fighters are used to a guy, you know, coming at him full steam attack. You know, um, you look at both both guys out the ring. You know, uh, you obviously got the whole situation with Top Rank and everybody behind Keyshawn. You know, um, I look, you know, um, the Instagram followings are pretty similar. You know, you got Kid Austin, over 100,000 Instagram, you know, um, followers. You know, obviously, Keyshawn Davis is not far behind, you know, so it's just, it's truly, it's truly something, you know, to, to talk about, you know, um, it would, is wild to have Kid Austin to have pretty much similar, you know, situations, you know, um, with, I'm trying to look at my man Keyshawn Davis. I want to get the right um, Instagram following from my man Keyshawn, but I know that they're clearly in the 100,000 column, you know, um, together, you know, so I just think because 113,000 followers on Instagram for Keyshawn Davis, and that's with a lot of backing, you know, uh, is what I'm trying to say. You, I'm, Kid Austin has done a lot uh, completely independent. You know, um, I just want to let everybody know that it's not a huge machine, ESPN, things of that nature. And he has 110,000 followers, you know, so clearly uh, that star powers are on a collision course as well. You know, uh, so I want people to think about that for one second, because to make these fights happen, it is a lot in the ring. But we all know what, what goes on outside. And hit, listen, the star power is there. Let's make it happen. You know, um, it's Flight Sports TV. I need everybody to put their picks in right now. We got a lot of Kid Austin content coming. Everybody hit that like button if you're rocking with the undefeated champion, the ABF lightweight continental champion of the world, to say, to be factual. If you're rocking with Kid Austin, hit that like button and follow Kid Austin 1 on Instagram. It's Flight Sports TV.